My channel is partially sponsored by USAMiniMotors.com. Please click the link in the description and subscribe to the channel. What is happening, friends? It is Friday the 11th. We're working just lunch shift again. Kind of taking it easy, just trying to make a few bucks, maybe trying to make a hundred bucks. Right now we have an order from Starbucks that's going close and an order from Albash that's going close. Starbucks there, Albash there, and both the customers about half a mile away. Starbucks first. What's up, buddy? How you doing, Good to see you. Good, good. Oh, I hope that big one's not mine. No. You guys got Neeks? You guys got Neeks for Uber? Neeks? Neeks? Thank you. Yeah, everything's pre tipped. And those big orders like that, I've spilled so many of those. I don't like them. I don't like them. <laughs> see you later. Pain in the ass and a slowdown on this coffee run. I can't figure out where to put the scooter. I don't see a safe spot. So I am going to tie it up. enough now we're off to Albash if I can figure out how to get out of here Ooh, what is this oh fuck that I'm not going to Wendy's is this the exit God damn, this is the place. yeah hello scooter all right this is great we stumbled into a double from Albash the Uber order is very good, like 1.2 or 3 miles for 11 bucks. The DoorDash order is not that good, but they're both probably ready. That's probably the best part of this story right here. I'm pretty sure they're both ready. Fuck. How you doing? Good, and I also have this one for uh, Uber. Oh no, that is that one. Okay, okay. Alright, I'm going to put this in my box. I'll be right back. Thanks, we'll see you next time. This is a nice spot for a drop-off. It looks like the guy's apartment is right here Hi. on the street. And what do you want me to do, sir? Let's see. Oh my God, I'm all tangled up here. What the fuck? Okay. Which order is this, first of all? Oh my God, I'm having problems, guys. Okay, one item. That's the top order. Good. That's the first Albash order down. Now we got number two. We're going to West Hollywood. A code to enter the building. Where exactly is the entrance? A little confusing here. A little confusing, huh? Is it here? There it is. All right, I guess we got a code. We're going in. <laughs> like that. All right, where are we going? 14. What is this one one for here? Hey, how you doing? Hey. Whoa, what a crazy nice building this is. 14, 13, 14, yay. Alrighty, this is probably the nicest fucking building I've ever seen in Hollywood. It's fucking amazing. Solid two mile, seven dollar order from Chipotle on Sunset. Let's go. Porch drop off. Oh, the porch all the way up there though. Where's the porch? Oh, here it is. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Eighty-three fifty-nine. Okay, this should be easy drop off according to the notes, I think. It's up there. Fuck it. I'm taking the scooter up here. Why would I walk up there? Yep. Perfect.
Hey, enjoy. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you. We have to go kind of far from here, 1.6 miles, but then the rest of the trip is like 0.4 miles for a nine and a half dollar Melrose and Stanley Starbucks. Let's go. So weird that there's not a bunch of people sitting out here. It threw me off. I forgot when there's no outdoor dining, that means there's no outdoor coffee either. Man, that sucks for people. That's a stupid fucking law. But we got it. Yeah, apartment number one. I love it. We all love apartment number one. Now we have another good Sunset Chipotle run. Seven bucks. 1.5 miles. Definitely a nice one. Let's go. I guess it's a little better for me that they close indoor dining because that kind of slows down the takeout process i noticed you notice that every order i picked up today was right on you know i walked right in and got it hopefully this order will be the same hey it's your doordash i'm here you got it so am i <laughs> thank you sir thank you very much my pleasure enjoy you too, bro. All right, easy enough. Now it looks like we're looking at a $10, 1.9 mile sweet green order. We're going to Sunset Strip. Let's go. I think it's up here. You know where we're fucking going. There's the champion. How you doing? This looks pretty easy. All right, and a half, eight and nine and a half. Okay, cool. Lucky I'm not scared of fucking dogs, right? I mean, this is crazy fucking. Thank you very much, enjoy. Two mile Kung Pao Bistro. We may be early. We're four minutes early. I mean, this place, we'll see. Without people having to focus on sit down customers, we might be okay. Hi. How you doing, kiddo? I have a Cassandra for DoorDash. Oh, I should look. Oh, not yet, not yet. Know. Okay. They put it on the wrong spot. Oh my God. Oh, All right, you, you hooked me up. Thank you yeah, very much. Because I knew it was ready. Okay, you're the best. See you next time. Delivering to some sort of uh, I don't know what the fuck the this is. The nation is on the left. 1403. Alright. Ring the bell. Okay, no problem. Oh, how you doing? Alrighty, we got some Kung Pao Bistro for you. Okay. Thanks and, so much. Hey, my pleasure. Enjoy. Okay, you too. Thank you. Two mile Chipotle run. DoorDash is saving our ass today. Uber Eats is not giving us much. Ready? Oh, thank you. The guy, you know, I'm not spending time in these restaurants. The guy says it's ready, and I'm standing there for a couple minutes. He doesn't give it to me, so I start leaving, you know? It's like, I don't need to talk to them. Just let your actions speak. And as I'm pulling out the door, he's like, sir. I'm like, buddy, I didn't say a fucking word, but coronavirus, COVID is fucking, I actually, for once will tell you, it's really spreading fast as fuck. I'm not hanging out in these goddamn restaurants. 
is one of my easy order spots. 937, number nine. Easy to figure out. Um, or not. Okay. Are you number six? Oh, fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy your Chipotle. You too. The $8 two mile all about the bread order going to Vista and Santa Monica. We're about a mile away from all about the bread. We're gonna leave Uber Eats on and try to get a double. We've had a pretty busy shift. We're not getting rich, but we're pretty busy. Maybe we'll get lucky in this place. We'll be ready. I don't know. This place can get really busy. They're not necessarily ever early. Hi guys, uh, I'm working on J Jake for DoorDash. I heard you, Papo. I heard you. Thanks, guys. Yeah, I'll do the same, but not See you guys. Thank you. Hi, it's your DoorDash. I am here. I wasn't sure what you wanted me to do. Actually, somebody just came in and oh, well, actually, she wouldn't let me in. So, okay, so I'm at the entrance. Boom, I'm in. My birthday. That's my birthday. Perfect. Okay, so I'll bring it to you. I'm coming. We're starting to get busy with a lot of these like meat and potato orders. Under two miles, seven dollars, six dollar orders. You can get fucking north on North Vista Street towards Santa Monica Boulevard, then continue on to North Gardner Street. That's what I think right now in this business. Volume is up. It's going to be busy because there's no outdoor dining, but I think tips are down. You know, it's like I think like an eight or nine dollar order is like those are four and five dollar tips. Those are good tips. But I'm getting like six and seven dollar orders. It's like people are tipping one dollar, two dollars, three dollars. It's not a bad tip, it's totally acceptable. But I think the days of, you know, oh, well, I'm so it's a pandemic, I'm gonna give you this extra tip, those days are slowly ending because, you know, we're, it's normal to take for granted service. I'm trying to make a left here, let's go, Chipotle. We went about earlier, you know, with these smaller orders, we got, you can make money on these under two mile, six and seven dollar orders. We're just not gonna have a big day. I don't know if we're gonna make 100 for lunch, but we're gonna do okay. I'm sure we'll make at least like 70 or 80. I remember at one point where a good lunch was 60, so if average is 70 or 80, I'll take it. Okay, so here we are at Chipotle. And how early are we? We're five minutes early, but they should be fucking ready. There's nobody in there. Mia. What is wrong with the app? This keeps happening. I keep opening it up. It's not telling me how much it pays. What the fuck? All right, so we're dropping off this DoorDash number three. Suite number three. Looks like the front gate is just open. We're just gonna walk right in. This is three, right? Yeah, so okay, much. enjoy. <laughs> Where are you? Hey Hunter, hey. enjoy. Thank you. Five dollar, point six mile McDonald's run. Excuse me buddy, not today, I'm working, I'm sorry. But good luck today. Two. Oh, thirteen thirty-five. I already see it. Oh.
We got an $8.50 order from Lala's. It's three miles. It might pay more. I don't think it is, though. It's only $20 worth of food. But that'll probably be our last order. And we might have made over 100 bucks for the session. I don't think we've even done three hours yet. So let's go to Lala's. Our last order of the day, for sure. I haven't complained once, by the way. I'm fucking freezing. Not that cold out, though. It's probably... Oh, 55 degrees. That's freezing for LA. Oh, I'm sorry. It's actually 62 degrees. <laughs> it feels colder in the shade, though. So, hey, buddy. Sir, pick it up. Hi, guys. It's freezing out there. I can't take it. Really? I mean, for me, I'm, I've lived here too long. I have er Eric. Eric? Uh, no. Okay, I'll come back. Uh, Eric S. Yeah, Eric S. Right there. I'll be right out front. Sure. Which is slow for this. I can get 40. If I want to go, this goes 50 miles an hour. I think I'm really out of gas because I'm tired. Because um, I could have taken the stairs. I actually waited for the fucking elevator. I almost never do that. But I'm just tired. It's cold, man. The cold makes me tired. This is definitely going to be our last order. We worked for three hours, 24 miles. I think we made over 100 bucks. You know, I'll give you the wrap up at the end. Let's get this food in front of the customer's door first. 404. things first of all that order paid 13 instead of 850 i mean that's very fucking nice and second of all the elevator is still here so that made life a lot easier so i don't know how much we made i'll give you numbers in a minute let's go home first that was 10 minutes 26.6 miles door to door guys if you like the video please like it subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below you know i'll write back see you guys tomorrow